Well, I always feel that I don't, you know, I'm thrilled that 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 many of the actors to whom I gave their first jobs have become successful, and I feel even more thrilled that many of the actors to whom I didn't give their first jobs, but whom I managed to pull out of anonymity, who had got had 30 or 40 or 50 jobs and whose careers were going over, that I was able to give them the part that changed their life. That's what's wonderful. That's that's why I love the Mary Tyler Moore show more than any show I ever cast, because except for Valerie, who was a gypsy and who no, had never done anything, had never had an acting role, that was a cast of people whose careers were not really going so well. Gavin McLeod was a wonderful actor, but he didn't work very much. I mean, he did Big Chicken on Hawaii Five-O a couple of times a year, and Ed Asner was a wonderful actor, a character actor, but his career wasn't exactly swimming along. Ted Knight's career was over. He was playing like, you know, the second cop or the second judge or something. And, and Cloris was a wonderful actress, but nobody, nobody thought she could do comedy. I mean, she, nobody would give her a comedy role. And so to put that cast together and have them all become so successful and create, have, I mean, have a whole new life. I mean, it gave Cloris a new life. It gave Ed a new life. It gave Ted Knight a whole new life. It gave Gavin a new life. That's what's wonderful, because you, these are people who were terrific and talented, and the world had sort of passed them by. They were hardworking, professionals, and they still would have kept working. But it was just great, because that show was a magical show, and everybody on that show, including Valerie, Valerie, you know, who, as I say, was a gypsy who'd never done anything. But it, uh, it was wonderful. That show was, was a joy to cast because Jim Brooks and Alan Burns were so wonderful. We saw millions of people because they wanted to see everybody. They said, we're going to see everybody uh, for this show. And we did. And they were so nice that everybody they saw thought they'd gotten a part. And finally, one day, Jim said, because I kept, I mean, like on Cloris, I kept bringing her back because I was so scared that we wouldn't cast her as Phyllis. And finally, one day, Jim was funny. He said, I just, you tried to tell us we really should cast Cloris Leachman as Phyllis. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> I think so, Jim. He said, well, since you bring her back every two weeks, I mean, it, all these weeks. So we cast her.